Some of you guys have problems connecting your smartphone to your Sony camera using the Monitor Plus app. Well, in this video, we'll be looking at what is causing the problem and how to solve it. The Monitor Plus app is a Sony camera exclusive app, which means that it will only work with Sony cameras. And you can connect your smartphone to your camera in two different ways. One is using the wireless connection and the other one is using the USB-C wired connection. Now, this is where the problems probably start. If you're using your iPhone, then you can only connect with the camera using the wireless connection because the wired connection is reserved for Android-powered smartphones. But if you're using a little bit older Sony camera, like I have the a7 III, then I cannot connect wirelessly with my smartphone because the app is not supporting this older camera. The app does support a little bit newer Sony cameras, but the a7 III is not supported for wireless connections, which means that I can only connect it using a USB-C to USB-C cable. This means that if you have an iPhone and an a7 III camera, you cannot connect them together because the wireless doesn't work for a7 III and the wired connection only works for an Android power device. So iPhones and a7 III will not work. But if you have a newer Sony camera where the wireless connection does work with the Monitor Plus app, then you can use your iPhone. So that covers the non-Android smartphone devices, but what is the problem with Android devices and a wired connection? Well, there's a lot of them actually. First, you need to set the settings both on the camera and on your Android smartphone to PC remote whenever you're connecting with a USB connection. Then your smartphone needs to be OTG or on-the-go USB connection compatible in order to work with the Monitor Plus app, otherwise it just doesn't work. Now the OTG or on-the-go USB basically means that you can connect any sort of USB cable into your smartphone phone using an adapter. Now why the app needs this connectivity is beyond me, but if your smartphone does not support it, then you will not be able to wire connect your Sony camera to your smartphone using the Monitor Plus app. Now that could be one of the problems that you guys have where you get the message device not supported on your app. So go and check if your smartphone is OTG compatible. Now the best way to check this is just to Google it, type in your smartphone model and does it support OTG and you will get a whole list of answers. And most newer smartphones support this. So I'm using the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus, which isn't the newest smartphone on the market and I do have the OTG, so basically it works. I'm looking at myself right now. There was also an issue with the app itself. With the update 1.0.4, you could now wire connect your camera and your smartphone even if you're using the app for free, so if you don't purchase the Pro version. So here are two examples showing how you can connect your smartphone to your camera, on one hand using the wireless connection and on the other hand using the wired connection. So for a wireless connection, the best thing to do is to set your Sony camera to a wireless connection where you get that QR code and you choose the scan QR code in the app and you just scan the QR code and the devices will be connected. If it says device not supported, well, that means that you have an older Sony camera just like I have my Sony a7 III. For a wired connection, you basically just connect both cables, one into the camera, one into your smartphone. You start the camera and you start the app and they should automatically be recognized and then you just press enter to get into your monitor mode. You can also check the auto connect checkbox. That means that when you power up your camera, the smartphone will immediately run the app and you will be in monitor mode. So it should be really that easy. But if you do have problems, then chances are that for a wired connection, your smartphone doesn't support OTG technology or your camera is not supported for a wireless connection with the Monitor Plus app. In both cases, either change the phone or change the camera in order to have this running. The Monitor app is a really cool app and this is not a sponsored video, but I do recommend that you buy the Pro version because with that you get all of the features that any professional video monitor offers and it's really fun to use and it's really easy to connect and you have your monitor always with you because it's your smartphone and the bigger that is, the bigger your monitor is going to be. So thanks for watching, I hope this helps. Please consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't subscribed already. Hit the like button and if you have any further questions or comments, please leave that down in the comment section where I would love to address all of that. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.